The next Seven Stars Terror Raid event has been announced for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. We're going to go through all of the details in today's video. So as you may have noticed, I am in a little bit of a different location. I visit my parents at the minute, so normal headquarters is not here at the minute. So we're making best do, but the next Seven Star event has been announced. So I did want to try and get a video up for you all as soon as possible on this new event. The new event has been announced, as you can see here, it will be Typhlosion off the back of that Samurott event ending last night. Typhlosion will be the next one and completing the trio of those Hisuian starter Pokemon, which is, in my mind, at least a big hint to what will be coming soon in being home compatibility for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. So we'll keep our fingers crossed for that one. But if we can take a look at the details of this event itself, as you can see here, the event will be running from the 14th of April this Friday until the 17th and that'll be the first phase of this Typhlosion raid event and it'll be running the second phase from the 21st of April until the 24th so we're gonna have those two phases as normal back-to-back -back weeks this Friday is the starting of these raid events and it will be a ghost terror type which is a big hint big throw to the Hisuian Typhlosion which has the fire and ghost typing uh, the thing other than that it's going to have the mightiest mark as usual you will be only able to catch one of these per save file um, but the details are pretty sparse other than what we've got here it's just going to be seven star strong ghost terror typing and there isn't much else to go on at the moment but those are the details and this is the pokemon that we're going to be getting this friday i'm very excited about it and i know probably a lot of you are as well in the run-up to these last three Pokemon that we've had. The Hisuian starter Pokemon are the ones that we're looking for. I think the Typhlosion is probably the most popular out of all of them. So hopefully you're looking forward to it. Of course, as well, we will be doing some best builds on the channel for this event in particular. So we'll get that up either tomorrow or Wednesday. Uh, but let me know down in the comment section below what you think will be a good build going into this one. First impressions for myself, something like Hydreigon going to be good with that dragon that resists the fire typing and the dark typing as well that resists the ghost things like Roaring Moon as well going to be another option there that are going to be good you've got to bear in mind that Typhlosion probably will have its hidden ability Flash Fire so it's going to resist any sort of fire type attacks it's probably going to play on Sunny Day as well as a setup for boosting the power of something like Eruption and then you're going to look at things like uh, Will-O-Wisp for boosting Hex damage if that's something it plays off for the Ghost Typing so there's a bunch of options that we can look at and we can really drill down and get some really strong builds put together going into this event so it'll make it easy for you to do when it drops later this week but thank you so much for tuning in it is a very quick one today obviously the setup and everything we can't really go into too much detail in this one but like i say i will drop the best builds video later this week but i would love to hear what you think of this new event this new announcement and i will see you all in another video very soon do drop a like do subscribe to the channel and i'll catch you all in another video very soon friends until then take care bye bye